key element of the UK Spine's mission is to support development of drugs which target biological drivers of aging. Toward this goal, the UK Spine's Bridge Program has funded the project, accelerating the development of drug repositioning and combination therapies for healthy aging. The principal investigator is Professor John Overington, Chief Information Officer of the Medicines Discovery Catapult. Data indicate that certain drugs currently approved for treatment of specific diseases are associated with increased lifespan. A subset of these drugs is being investigated for potential repositioning as intervention which supports improved health span. Repositioning requires reinvestigation in relation to this distinct intended use to gain regulatory approval for a new indication both safety and efficacy need to be demonstrated in relation to this new indication. Age-associated multimorbidity leads to significant incidence of polypharmacy in the elderly. Safety data regarding toxicity and drug-drug interactions will play an important role in de-risking the selection of candidate drugs for repositioning. This work systematizes the prioritization of opportunities for repositioning and repurposing drugs to support healthy aging in relation to safety considerations. Toxicity will be considered, and given the prevalence of polypharmacy in multimorbid populations, drug-drug interactions must also be interrogated. Using bioinformatics methods, a safe set of drugs and drug combinations will be generated. Search parameter identification and refinement will generate a parameter set of disease. This will involve drawing on data regarding prototypical polypharmacy, tolerated levels of side effect incidence, and contraindications. Analytical workflows will be developed to apply the parameter set to pharmaceutical databases of approved drugs, opportunities to develop new therapies and novel combinations of therapeutics and repositioning strategies suitable for an elderly population will thus be identified. The results of this work will spur new drug development and repositioning programs. It will support an accelerated route to clinic by de-risking the discovery process. The results of this work will be broadly disseminated and opportunities to amplify and extend its utility through new collaborations will be explored. Drugs designed to mitigate aging would be protective against multiple morbidities via a single intervention. The path to regulatory approval isn't clear for such drugs. Professor Overington offers his thoughts on the question, what role might the project play in resolving the regulatory path for drugs which target the biological drivers of aging? Here we're working on a project involving the identification of a safe set of drugs or safer set of drugs to explore for repositioning opportunities in an elderly population. And this is quite a complicated factor because elderly people tend to have poorer kidney and liver function. Also many of them have um, associated pathology with degradation of the effectiveness of the blood-brain barrier and so elderly patients per se tend to be more uh, sensitive to drug side effects than uh, a younger uh, population would be. And this is combined with the high level of um, polypharmacology in this patient group as well, with the concomitant um, incidence or, or potential for drug-drug interactions. So this project is aiming to identify the sort of features of drugs, the physical, chemical and pharma pharmaceutical features of drugs that are well tolerated in an elderly population, and also provide some benchmark data to current UK uh, prescribing in uh, an elderly population that new agents would need to coexist alongside.